Okay, so today I'm going to make Trader Joe's vegetable fried rice using the Hamilton Beach digital steamer. Uh, you can also make uh, regular steamed rice using uh, the steamer here, and I have a video on how to do that, and I'll put the link below. But this morning we're going to make vegetable fried rice from Trader Joe's. Okay, so we're just going to use the bottom portion, so I'm going to remove the top portion. You can use the top portion as well. You can put veggies up here. Uh, but today I'm just going to use the bottom to make the rice. Uh, so we'll put the lid on here. And then we have to fill the reservoir. I've put in some water. I just wanted to show you. Oops, I need to remove this also. This, this will uh, catch the water. So here we're going to fill up the reservoir. And we're going to put it right a little bit above low water, okay? Because this is not going to steam for very long. This is already, uh, the rice is already fully cooked. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and do that. This is the tray for the rice, and you can use steamed rice or um, any kind of rice that you'd like. So we're going to put this in here. And, and this will cook about for about 15 minutes. The recipe here is, calls for cooking on the stove top and using uh, oil, vegetable oil, and a nonstick frying pan or wok. So we're going to do it here on the steamer, and we should get um, the same results, just as good. So I'm going to set this. It's flashing at. 20 minutes, I'm going to go down to 15 minutes, and um, it'll stop blinking in a minute, and then we'll go ahead and start. We have our water here, almost at max, not quite. Uh, this feature is really nice. If you wanted to, to make some steamed rice, you can use delay time, and then that could, uh, say you're working or you're running errands and you want the rice to be ready when you get home, you would use the delay time and that'll delay uh, several hours. Um, and when it's on delay, this little light will blink. Right now it's it's on the cook, it's cooking. And when it's done, it's going to beep and then it'll automatically click over to warm and it'll stay on the warm uh, feature for up to an hour. So it'll keep your food warm up to one hour. And then uh, here's the cook time, which we did. This is your up and down arrows. If you wanted to increase or decrease your on and off button. It's very simple. Like I said, it has a second tier here. Um, we could have put some veggies on the second part if you wanted to. And this is removable. So if you wanted to stack uh, some corn on the cob, you can do that. And I'm going to do a video on that because the corn on the cob in this steamer is amazing and I will do a video on that coming up soon. So I'm going to uh, let this cook and then I'll come back and we'll take a look and take a taste test and see how it goes. Okay the rice is done. It's been steaming for 15 minutes uh, and this was the vegetable fried rice from Trader Joe's. This is in the frozen department, so it's frozen. It says it contains soy and wheat. This doesn't have any egg uh, or anything like that. Um, so let's take a taste. I'm gonna take the lid off. Put that over here on the side. Oh, yum, yum, yum. Oh, that looks very good. Okay, so I'm gonna see if I can take this out. Look how beautiful that looks. I hope you can see that. That looks so good. Um, I'm gonna set it over here on the table or on the counter. Let me just put some on here. You could serve this with chicken, vegetables, whatever you'd like. Um, and like I said, this doesn't contain eggs in it. Well, let's see. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is, oh, it's hot. This is so good. I didn't use any vegetable oil. Oh, this is very good. 
you haven't tried it, mm, you can try this. It's quick and easy. Not bad for being frozen. Actually, it's very great. I hope you liked this video. I hope this was helpful to you. I'm going to go ahead and unplug this. If um, you found this video helpful, please share, like, and subscribe. Thank you so much. Again, I'll let you, I will definitely make a video on corn on the cob to show you that because it tastes scrumptious. And it is juicy and it's not waterlogged. It's crunchy, it's, it's sweet, and it's perfect, and it comes out perfect each time. And again, that was using the second tier. But again, thank you so much for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. Bye. Look at all of the buffalo. Ricky, move your head. They're just here wild.